Hi folks, Nathaniel here at Chicago Music Exchange. Uh, we're in my living room again. And today we're checking out this wonderful Gretsch Custom Shop Caddy Bob, master built by Stephen Stern. Now as you can tell, it's quite a unique looking guitar. Beautiful, I think, I love it. It features an all solid Carina body and neck, beautiful Brazilian rosewood fingerboard, and also a throwback SLE 101 PAF humbuckers. Now, what is a Caddy Bob? Um, it originates with Bo Diddley, who gave his Thunderbird guitar to Billy Gibbons of ZZ Top. Billy wasn't too keen on bringing it on the road with him, so he decided to work with Gretsch to recreate the model, and it eventually became known as the Billy Bolt Jupiter Thunderbird. Quite a mouthful. This eventually evolved, with the help of Stephen Stern, uh, into the Caddy Bolt. Now, the main differences between the two is that the Caddy Bolt features an all-solid uh, contoured body, whereas the Billy Bolt features a chambered, non-contoured body. So once a year, the team here at CME heads out to Corona, California to work with Gretsch master builder Stephen Stern to fully spec out guitars for you to enjoy. Uh, last year, we created a caddy bow and you can check that out in the video below in the link uh, that our good friend Joel did. So the only real difference between this guitar and the previous caddy bow that we made is the pickguard. Uh, the previous one was a tortoise pickguard, whereas this is an aged parchment. So the core of the guitar is the same. Of course, we got this gorgeous Carina body. The Brazilian rosewood neck. Now, you probably don't want to be cutting it up too much, so we've gone with thumb inlays, which look cool. So as mentioned, the humbuckers, we've got throwback SLE 101 PAFs, and these are made in Kalamazoo in Michigan. And many of them are actually on the original 1950s Gibson machinery, which is cool, uh, and they sound great. So I really like this guitar. I'll admit the, the shape kind of threw me off at first, but I've grown to love it. It looks really cool. Neck feels good. Uh, even just the little things. I love the tuners, you know, uh, little things like that. This is kind of cool, the volume plate here. It's different, so I kind of like it. I'm not the biggest fan of this joint here. It's quite big, um, but that's just me. Some of you might think it's brilliant and, you know, it's your, it's your thing. Um, I love the tailpiece, the whole lot. But again, the shape, I mean, that's a cool looking guitar. Come check it out. 